Hey guys, welcome back to another cigar review from Corona Cigar Company. My name is Ryan, and today we're going to be talking about the Aladino Cameroon. So, today we're going to be talking about the Aladino Cameroon. Now, while Cameroon is still grown in Africa, the Aroa family really, really enjoys the challenge of growing their own tobacco and making the cigar a truly unique experience. So they ended up growing the Cameroon in the Yamastron Valley of Honduras. So talking about the tobaccos that are in this cigar, it's all grown in Honduras by the Aroa family. The binder and filler are both Honduran Corojo that they are absolutely famous for. And the wrapper, as I said before, is a Cameroon wrapper that they're growing on their farm. Now the reason that they really wanted to do this is because Julio Aroa, the father, takes a lot of pride in his ability to grow tobacco. And so he took seeds from Africa and decided to do it himself and turned out with a really, really nice cigar. The wrapper on this cigar has a really nice reddish brown hue to it. Very, very smooth, not super veiny. Um, and then you come up here to the band. It's got that really nice, aesthetically pleasing red and silver going on. It gives a nice old timey look. All right, guys, let's go ahead and get right into the excitement of cutting and lighting the cigar. Now on the cold dry, you guys are going to notice a nice little bit of a sweetness and hopefully that should come through on the rest of the cigar. Now on that first puff, that sweetness still definitely comes through, but you start to get a little bit more of that Corojo flavor that some of you might be used to. So you're going to get a lot of that leatheriness, um, a little bit more of a, uh, more of a richer taste to it. All right guys, so now we've gotten into this a little bit. Um, the sweetness is becoming much more of like a nutty sweetness. Think of like some nice almond butter or something of, of that nature. And um, there's also a little bit of spice that comes through, which adds a nice little bit of complexity to the cigar. As we can see, the burn line is pretty dang perfect. Really well aged cigar. It's a beautiful whitish gray ash. It's holding together really nicely. And the the best part, in my opinion, on this cigar is really the body. It's it's very standard medium body, but it fills your taste buds with flavor and really makes you feel like you're having a true cigar. This cigar has a beautiful smoke to it. As you can see, it's aesthetically rolling down the cigar, so it makes a great cigar for your Instagram pictures. So this cigar is going to be for really just about anybody. It's really nicely in that middle zone to where if you like a lighter cigar, you can handle it just fine. And if you like a heavier cigar, it's got enough body to it that you're still gonna feel like you're smoking a cigar. And really, you know, when people are smoking a cigar and they're out and about, they're usually gonna be pairing it with something. And this is one of those cigars that's gonna go really nicely with a nice rum or maybe even a cognac. Personally, I like Florida Cana. And as a sipping rum, I think this would match up beautifully. So, if you wanna try a cigar that's got old time flavor and new time complexity, Make sure you go to one of our stores or go online to coronacigar.com and try the new Cameroon Aladino.